Hey y'all! Welcome to B's Intuition. I'm B, and I'm back with another general collective energy message. Thank you guys for tuning in. I really appreciate it. I do cuss and I do tell the truth, so if you don't like either one of the two, then you probably should move on. I've already prayed over the cards and the energy, so we're just going to hop in and get this message. Please remember to like, share, and most importantly, subscri subscribe, especially to those of you that are viewing the channel but have not yet subscribed. You don't want to miss out on the messages that God has for you. Also, please remember to take what resonates only and leave the rest for whoever it's for. Every message will not be your message. So with that being said, y'all, let's hop in. So, y'all, I definitely did uh, channel some things yesterday. Um, and one of the things that I channeled yesterday was attack, attack, attack. And then at the end of attack, 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 I heard adversary. So adversary means enemy. Um, so with that being said, uh, somebody's enemy, you know, uh, could be trying to attack them in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Or somebody's enemy is being attacked. Also, when I um, heard the the word adversary, it kind of gave me, you know what I'm saying, like Satan, you know, like the devil. So, somebody's enemy could be being attacked by the devil. Or somebody's enemy could be trying to use the devil to attack them. I really feel like somebody's enemy is being attacked, though. Um, it could be, you know, many things. It could be, you know... Uh, by, you know, the devil, but it could be also, you know, being attacked by their own mind, their own demons, um, the, the, their, the, the, the people that are around them, you know what I'm saying? Uh, they could be being attacked on social media, um, they could be being attacked by some type of mental health issue, uh, they could be being attacked by some type of physical health issue, like it's some type of, um, sickness or something was laying dormant in somebody. Um, it definitely could be, you know, uh, waking up you know within somebody here um i definitely do feel like that yeah somebody's enemy is being attacked here and i feel like that it could be more than just one person or somebody's enemy could just be being attacked um when it comes to uh somebody's spiritual team somebody's ancestors because i picked up on a lot of years and a lot of numbers so i feel like that these years could be the years that uh, people were born in the and so in these numbers because it's not a lot of years or numbers but it's a lot if that makes sense um and some of these numbers could be you know the age of some of these people whether it be uh somebody's enemies or you know what i'm saying somebody's ancestors um the years 1986 1981 1985 1990 1993 1984 could be significant um, the number is 34, 49, 24, 43, 33 could be significant. The angel number 808 could be significant. The angel number 223 could be significant. I feel like the inevitable is happening or the inevitable, you know what I'm saying, is, is it has, has started here. I'm also picking up too, if there was some type of spiritual ceasefire, like some type of temporary spiritual ceasefire um that could be over with so if somebody or people caused a spiritual warfare against somebody um that could be um ramping back up and so with that being said as far as the inevitable happening the inevitable is that yeah um the winner is always the light side you know um especially you know in, in the spiritual realm because yeah um, God is, is definitely in control, you know what I'm saying? Alpha, Omega, beginning and the end. And so with that being said, yeah, I feel like that uh, if, if there is a ceasefire, you know what I'm saying? Like a temporary ceasefire uh, that, that has been lifted. I feel like that, yeah, the, the war is going to continue. Um, but I feel like that it's, it's about to come to an end. And there definitely could be, you know what I'm saying? A lot of inevitable things um, uh, that are uh, happening, you know? So 
yeah, it's it's kind of like, yeah, people being attacked, you know what I'm saying? Uh, like if, if people were cyberbullying, people could be being cyberbullied or people, you know, not not necessarily being cyberbullied, but people could be in, being attacked. Um, you know what I mean? Um, on social media or people's, you know, electronics could be being attacked. You know what I'm saying? By, uh, you know, viruses. Um, somebody could, you know, just catch some type of virus, you know, physical virus, you know, and they uh, can't come back from it. Uh, somebody's mental health could just take over to the point to where, yeah, they, they, they can't come back from it. And, you know what I'm saying? They, they have a mental breakdown to the point to where they have to go to a mental health facility. Um, somebody's kids, you know what I'm saying, just could get so out of control, you know what I'm saying, that, yeah, at a young age, they, uh, you know, get locked up, or, you know what I'm saying, they, they do some things to find themselves in front of a judge, or whatever the situation is, um, you know, somebody's household, or some people's households, or just, you know, could get so out of control, you know what I'm saying, that there's, yeah, no return, there, you know what I mean, um, but I feel like the, yeah, somebody's enemies definitely could be being attacked, you know, and again, this could be somebody's ancestors that could be attacking these people. Um, or it could be, you know what I'm saying, their own uh, their own people that could be attacking them. You know, again, their own demons, their own thoughts, their own, you know what I'm saying, uh, physical or mental health uh, situations is attacking them. You know what I mean? Um, yeah. And it could be, yeah, the devil that could be attacking these people. Um, and maybe, yeah, the devil was, was told by the Most High, like, um, yeah, since you allow these people to, you know what I'm saying, uh, attack, you know, without permission, you know, um, yeah, you have to make sure that you help to defend this person now. Um, and that could be, uh, you know, an inevitable thing that's happening, you know what I mean? Um, you know, I feel like that if, if these people did use, you know what I'm saying, Satan or the devil, you know what I'm saying, to attack somebody, these people didn't think that, yeah, it was going to backfire on them. They, they, they possibly didn't think that, you know, the devil was going to go from, you know, being an enemy with them to being an ally with, you know, whoever is going to resonate with this message. So, yeah, attack, attack, attack. <laughs> so, with that being said, y'all, let's hop in and, uh, yeah, see what's going on. Holy Spirit, what's going on with this attack, attack, attack? Ah, this definitely could be somebody's ancestors, because this is my ancestor card. Mm-hmm, and then this is, yeah, my bond, my pack card. So whoever is resonating with this message, you definitely do have some type of um, bond, some type of, you know what I'm saying, pact when it comes to uh, your ancestors here. I feel like that uh, there are a couple of ancestors um, that somebody was close to, you know what I'm saying, like really close to, like this could be somebody's mom, you know what I'm saying, because this looks like a, you know, like a mother uh, ancestor and a baby ancestor, Um so this could be like a mom, you know what I mean? Or this could be, you know, like a, a paternal figure in somebody's life, this ancestor here. But yeah, and whoever this ancestor is, I feel like that, yeah, they're a high-ranking ancestor. And they are leading, you know what I'm saying, the, the they're leading the pack here. Wow. So it definitely could be somebody's ancestors, you know what I'm saying, that are, yeah, attack, attack, attack. And yeah, and, it, and it's something about, yeah, I was just getting ready to say, God's promise. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we saw the we saw the bond packed card, and then here goes, um, yeah, the, 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 the crucified card. And that's literally what I'm going to call this um, card, the crucified card, because you got the sun, you know what I'm saying, behind this person. So yeah, the son of God, which is Jesus, and look, got their arms stretched out. So yeah. God's promise is being fulfilled, you know what I'm saying? At least one of God's promises is being fulfilled. So whoever's resonating with this message, you know, you know what I'm saying? The the promises that God, you know, uh, made, you know, as far as for your protection, your, your safety, your stability, whatever promises that God made to you, you know what I'm saying? You know, and, and yeah, they're being fulfilled. There also, yeah, could be some type of prophecy that could be being fulfilled as well. So this could be literally like a David and Goliath situation, you know? 
Um, but I feel like the yeah. I feel like that whoever's resonating with this message, you made a lot of sacrifices, you know what I'm saying? As far as going through, you know what I'm saying? Um, um, this spiritual warfare or going, you know what I'm saying? Choosing one to get on your spiritual journey. Two, you know what I'm saying? Walking in your truth. Three, you know what I'm saying? Standing up, you know what I'm saying? To the enemy. And so, yeah, I feel like that, um, because, you know what I'm saying? You've, you've made a lot of sacrifices, you know what I'm saying? Because you have trudged through the mud with your ancestors. So with that being said, yeah, um, in the spirit, you know what I'm saying? You definitely could be, could have been on the front lines with your, with your ancestors fighting the spiritual warfare. And then on top of that, in the physical, yeah, you could have still been going to war. You know what I'm saying? Like, again, people could have been ta attacking you, you know what I'm saying? Um, on social media, people could have been, you know what I'm saying? Um, trying to attack your kids on social media or if you have them or you know what i'm saying uh people could have been you know doing spells and they could have been you know trying to manifest on on the physical you know what i'm saying you could have you know been feeling a lot of things you know what i'm saying um from uh the the negative things that were being thrown your way but you still stood tall you still stood your ground you know what i'm saying you yeah you you fought the good fight is what i is what i'm picking up so i feel like the yeah um your ancestors are proud of you. The Most High is proud of you. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like the, yeah, um, I feel like the closer, uh, you're closer to, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're as close to, to yeah, the Most High, to Jesus that you can get. You know what I'm saying? You're you're close. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that, because uh, we saw the Promise card, but that's also my Bond card, my Pat card. So, yeah. Um... It's kind of like, yeah, you're you're very close, you know what I'm saying? So with that being said, I feel like that along the way, you know what I'm saying, along your spiritual journey, you know what I'm saying, uh, while this spiritual warfare has been going on, because I feel like it's been going on for a long time, yeah, I feel like that you've came closer, closer, closer to Jesus, you know what I'm saying? And so, yeah, the Bible says in order to get through, you know what I'm saying, to the Most High, you got to go through Jesus first. And so, yeah, I feel like that you definitely have a bond, you know what I'm saying, with Jesus, and I feel like that you are, you're, you're getting closer, you know what I'm saying, uh, 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 to the most high here, this is, this is beautiful, mm-hmm, yep, yeah. I feel like that, yeah, you showing gratitude, you know what I'm saying, just saying, just waking up saying thank you, you know what I'm saying, is, is, it feels, you know what I'm saying, uh, uh, your ancestors with, with so much joy, you know what I'm saying? You just, yeah, being thankful for the sun and, you know what I'm saying, the way it sets or the way it rises, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you being thankful, you know what I'm saying, even for the clouds, for the rain, you know, I feel like that, yeah, whoever's resonating with this person, you're a very gracious person. And I feel like that, yeah, during, you know, during this time of war, during this time of pain, during this time of whatever, or just times of war or times of pain, period, I feel like that you didn't, um, you didn't complain. On the back of the card, it says, uh, what are you most grateful for in life? Mm -hmm. I feel like, yeah, whoever's resonating with this message, you're grateful for the small things. Um, so, yeah, what happens when you get blessed with the big things? You know what I mean? And I feel like that that's literally what's going to take place because you have been grateful for the small things because you didn't complain because you, yeah. You rode the wave, you know what I'm saying? You trusted in, in Jesus, you, you you trusted in the Most High, you know what I'm saying? You you listened to your ancestors, you know what I'm saying? You allowed your, your spirit uh, spirit guides to guide you. Uh, you allowed your guardian angels to protect you, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like, the, yeah, you're definitely getting ready to get something great here. But we still got to talk about the attack, attack, attack. <laughs> And so, yeah, they could have, they could have attacked, you know what I'm saying, Jesus, you know what I'm saying, uh, as far as, like, committing blasphemy, you know what I'm saying, um, or they could have attacked, attacked you, and yeah, Jesus took offense to it, you know what I'm saying, um, yeah, I feel like that, uh, whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you have a great bond, you know what I'm saying, with your ancestors, with your, with your guardian angels, you know what I'm saying, with your spirit guides, with, with Jesus, you know what I'm saying, and so, yeah, as long as you have a great bond with Jesus, then, yeah, you, you get to have a bond with the Most High, and so I feel like that, yeah, all your, all your, uh, eyes are dotted and all your T's are crossed when it comes to, you know what I'm saying, your loyalty, you know what I'm saying, your, your patience, um, your resilience, uh, your obedience, uh, your gratitude, I feel like, yeah, and so with that being said, yeah, how can, uh, why wouldn't, you know what I'm saying, uh, the war go, go in, go on your behalf, you know what I'm saying, why wouldn't you be the victim? 
victorious one. You know what I'm saying? And so, yeah, the inevitable is happening. Victory. It's what I'm picking up. Oh, here we go. Hee-haw. Hee-haw. <laughs> so, yeah, we got a bunch of jackasses out here. So, there's a bunch of jackasses out here. Um, you know what I'm saying? Uh, that, yeah, they're looking like jackasses now. And I feel like it's because, uh, yeah, the, the inevitable is happening. And I feel like that they know why it's happening. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. They know how they know, yeah, why it's happening. Um, this is my skills card. This is also like my spiritual gifts card, but this is, yeah, all the tools, you know what I'm saying, that you need, you know what I'm saying, to, to, to work on something or to fix something. So, yeah, I feel like that whoever you know is resonating with this message, you are the tools in the toolbox, you know what I'm saying? You are the tools and you are the toolbox. But yeah, I feel like, but these are also weapons, you know what I'm saying, ammo. And so yeah, I feel like that uh, a lot of things are being thrown at whoever's resonating with this message in some way, shape, form, or fashion, whether it be spiritually or physically or both. Um, but I feel like that, yeah, again, whoever's resonating with this message, you stood your ground, you know what I'm saying, and, and you and you wasn't going to accept defeat because yeah, you remember the promise, you know what I'm saying, that that was made, you know what I'm saying, to you about your protection, about your stability, about your safety, you know what I'm saying, about, you know, as long as you stay obedient, this is what's going to happen, as long as you do this, this is what's going to happen, so I feel like that, yeah, your spiritual team is very, very proud of you because, yeah, you allow them to guide you, you know what I'm saying, you listened again, and you, you know what I'm saying, you trusted and had faith that, yeah, what they said was true, and yeah, you were going to come out on top. So I feel like that, yeah, you're you're definitely being given, uh, or you've already been given, you know what I'm saying, some 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 more ammo here. But I feel like that this ammo, you know what I'm saying, that 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 is that has been given to you or is being given to you. These people don't know nothing about it. Mm-hmm. It's like, yeah, don't bring a knife to a gunfight type of deal. Mm-hmm. So these people have some they have knives and 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 and, and hammers and you know what I'm saying hooks and stuff but yeah you you definitely do have you know a, a gun a spiritual gun yeah so that would explain why that uh angel number 223 came out mhm mm yeah spiritual AK you know what I'm saying a uh, spiritual AR15 you know what I mean yeah yeah i just heard sharpshooter so whoever's resonating with this message, you could be a sharpshooter, like, you know what I'm saying, spiritually or physically, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, a good shot. So with that being said, yeah, uh, I just heard being taken down one by one. So somebody's ancestor definitely could be a sniper or whoever's resonating with this message could be a spiritual sniper, physical sniper or both. This is giving me like somebody that, you know what I'm saying, has had some type of training. You know what I'm saying? This could be police training, military training, some type of training here. You know what I'm saying? But this is also skills card. So with that being said, yeah, whoever... Um, is uh resonate with this message yeah you got the you got the skills to pay the bills you know what i mean um yeah you are the whole package you are the tools and you are the toolbox so people feel like a jackass because yeah how you gonna come up against somebody you know what i'm saying that is the tools and the toolbox you know what i'm saying when you need a tool or two you know what i mean I feel like that whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you already had enough ammo, you know what I'm saying, when 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 this started. You already had enough ammo, you know what I'm saying, before people decided to, yeah, attack, attack, attack. But along the way, you know what I'm saying, you uh you uh, gained more and more ammo. And then on top of that, yeah, I feel like that there was some type of ceasefire. You know what I'm saying? Temporary ceasefire. And so yeah, I feel like that these people that were sitting around cackling, hee haw, hee haw. Well, whoever's resonating with this message was continuing to gather up, you know what I'm saying? More and more ammo. And so, yeah, now these people really feel like jackasses. And it's because, yeah, they're like, how are we going to defend ourselves against all that? They got like, uh, like 20 warehouses full of ammo. You know what I'm saying? We got a trunk full of ammo. What are we going to do with that? Yeah. So, yeah, there definitely could be a lot of people 
um, that feel like jackasses right now. But it's because, yeah, um, these people are being picked apart. These people are being, you know what I'm saying, nailed, you know what I'm saying, to the cross that they wanted you to be nailed to. These people, yeah, it could be a, could be being chopped up on the inside, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, these people definitely are hooked on things, you know what I'm saying, that they possibly wanted you to be hooked on. Um, yeah, somebody or people are doing a lot of, hell of a lot of drinking, you know what I mean? That's an airplane. Yeah, every time, because every day there's an airplane that goes past when I'm uh, doing messages and I feel like that yeah that is somebody's ancestors um, but it, but it's always but it also gives me like air sign energy so Libra Gemini Aquarius mm-hmm I just heard heavy Gemini so yeah uh, these people um, yeah they could have to use like flashlights and uh, 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 candles because yeah um, they don't have any electricity or they can't afford to pay their bills you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. Things are being ironed out for whoever's resonating with this message or straightened out for whoever's or they're, it's getting ready to be. So that could be another thing, you know, when it comes to uh, the inevitable happening here. I feel like a lot of things are taking place on the behalf of whoever's resonating with this message. Mm-hmm. What does success mean to you? So yeah, victory. Somebody definitely could work for IT. You know what I'm saying? Um, somebody, yeah. Or somebody knows somebody that works for IT. Uh, somebody from IT that works for IT definitely was helping some people. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to something on uh, social media. Uh, somebody from IT, you know, or that works in IT or something like that definitely could have help somebody or some people to like transmute some type of um, virus to somebody's electronics but I feel like it backfired so somebody's electronics is, you know what I'm saying kind of messing up or whatever the situation is yeah that could have been why um, but I feel like the yeah was cleared out whoever's resonated with this message um, you can you know you can protect everything you know what I'm saying whatever you do as far as a protection ritual you can do it to your phone you can do it to your laptop your iPad your TVs your remote controls whatever it is you know what I'm saying as long as you speak it into existence you know what I'm saying that it is, it is protected yeah it is so um, so with that being said yeah if you feel like the things you know what I'm saying are just weird or whatever I don't care if it's if it's you know what I'm saying your remote control I don't care you know what I'm saying if it is your phone yeah Say you can do a little sage, a little Palo Santo, you know what I'm saying? Whatever you need, you know what I'm saying? But um, yeah. This is victory card though. And it's something about, yeah, social media. Um somebody could have, yeah, a lot of skills when it comes to like um electronics, but they could also have a lot of skills when it comes to like um Yeah, somebody could be a teacher out here. Somebody definitely, yeah, could be a... Yeah, it's like a carpenter. So, like, Jesus was a carpenter. You know what I'm saying? But Jesus was a man of many things. So, whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you not you don't only have physical skills, but you have spiritual skills as well. So, that's why, you know what I'm saying? You're, that's why victory is yours. You know what I'm saying? Um, and so, when you combine those two, yeah, you're a powerhouse. Or when whoever, you know what I'm saying? They're a powerhouse. And so, yeah, I feel like that, yeah, somebody's a powerhouse. Mm -hmm. And then on top of that, it's showing, you know what I'm saying? Um, a lot of people can see something take place here. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of people that are getting ready to see something take place as well. And it definitely could be on the internet. Mm -hmm. somebody's brother and somebody's sister um, is definitely involved in something here this could be um, yeah th this could be you know some of the ones that feel like a uh, jackass you know uh, mm -hmm. they feel like jackasses they they definitely are the ones that yeah um, provided some ammo for sure whatever this ammo means Spiritual journey card. 
And then on the back of the card, it says, what does freedom mean to, to you? So, yeah. Look who's getting ready to have the victory. And look who's getting ready to be free. You know what I'm saying? Of, of these enemies here. Um, yeah. And I'm also picking up, too. If, if, if. Because this is like uh, my twin flame card, too. Um, if, if there was a twin flame that, you know, was under some type of stronghold, um, or, or, you know what I'm saying, under, you know what I'm saying, some type of, yeah, hold, or on hold, is what I just heard, yeah, something is being freed, so there, so, uh, a divine counterpart could be being freed, um, it could definitely be a masculine energy, because it's a masculine energy on this card, um, And it's something about, yeah, things are being made straight. Whatever somebody was doing um, on the internet. It, it yeah, definitely um, was to try to get somebody to exit the premises or try to get somebody, you know, exed out. I just heard exile. So somebody definitely could be being exiled, but it ain't whoever's resonating with this message for sure. Um, whoever's resonating with this message, you definitely are on your spiritual journey. Um, but I feel like that, yeah, if there was a divine counterpart, uh, a twin flame, for those of you that are on a twin flame journey that was bound to something or, you know what I'm saying, they, they felt stuck or they felt trapped, yeah, they're becoming free. If somebody was locked up, they're becoming free. Mm-hmm. Free your mind and the rest will follow. Be colorblind. Don't be so shallow. Mm -hmm. So somebody, yeah, somebody's mind could be being free. Yeah, it could be, you know, um, whoever's resonating with this message. Or it could be that divine counterpart or the twin flame. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, I feel like that, uh, yeah, freedom avails. You know what I'm saying? Pre uh, prevails. Uh, victory, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, uh, there's a lot of people that are going to have to watch this victory. Mm -hmm. I feel like if there were a lot of people that was making fun of somebody... <laughs> yeah, and somebody don't even know why. <laughs> mm hmm Wow. I don't know. <laughs> that's that's what I'm getting with this car. I don't know, but this is uh, what you're talking about with this car. Mm hmm Yeah, but it's also like, yeah, what you talk about, Willis, like, uh, y'all couldn't beat me on your best day, you know what I'm saying? Or it's kind of like, yeah, uh, it really doesn't matter, you know what I'm saying? Because I, I, I already, I've already been given instruct. I feel like whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you were given instructions along the way, you know what I'm saying? The whole time that this spiritual, this specific spiritual warfare has been going on, yeah, you've been given instructions, um, all this way all along the way excuse me and yeah I feel like that um regardless I feel like I feel like whoever's resonating with this message you know the victory is yours because that's the promise you know what I'm saying um for for all of us you know what I'm saying that choose the light side and not the dark side yeah it, it, the promise is as long as we you know what I'm saying follow the rules you know what I'm saying uh follow the agenda you know what I'm saying we're going to come out on top and so I feel like the yeah you've done that you've done that exceptionally um and that's why you've been given a lot of extra you know what I'm saying ammo this could be you know what I'm saying spiritual gifts that you don't know about this could be literally other physical like physical skills you know what I'm saying that you haven't even tapped into so I feel like whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, there's a lot of things, you know what I'm saying, that you possibly need to be doing at this time. You know what I'm saying? As far as uh, creating things, making things happen, you know what I'm saying? And it definitely could have something to do with the internet. Or you could already be creating things, making things happen on the internet. But I feel like there's other things, you know what I'm saying, many things within you, you know what I'm saying? And so, yeah, I feel like it's time for you to start pulling those things out. It's time for you to start creating um, more things on top of what you already, you know what I'm saying, have uh, gotten established here 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I feel like that, yeah, there's a divine counterpart that's about to be free. I feel like that whoever's resonating with this message, I feel like that, yeah, you're free. Um, but you're definitely getting ready to be free, you know what I'm saying, of this specific spiritual uh, warfare here. Um, but it's something about, yeah, so, uh, the divine counterpart being free. So, yeah, if they were on that side or if they were locked up or chained, you know what I'm saying, by these people, you know what I'm saying, no, you can't leave and we're going to go against, you know what I'm saying, your divine counterpart and you're going to watch us. Yeah, I feel like that that's no longer no longer um, going to be able to, to happen. I feel like that, yeah, a divine counterpart could be being freed here. Um, somebody definitely could be being freed from spiritual jail, you know what I'm saying, mental jail. It could be this divine counterpart, somebody's twin flame. Um, or somebody is yes, to inflame divine counterpart could have been locked up and they could be being released, you know? Somebody could uh live where the mountains are. But yeah, I feel like somebody's on top of, you know what I'm saying, the mountain. Not down in the valley, on top of the mountain. Mm-hmm. Wow. Mm-hmm. Be aware of you finding out some information. You know what I'm saying? And and, and somebody acts like they don't know what uh you talking about. Like if they was in uh Zamunda when, when something took place, when they really weren't, when they were really sitting by the person, you know what I'm saying, that 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 hit the button, you know what I'm saying? That hit the send button. Be aware of that as well. I'm also uh, picking up too that yeah, if somebody is free or somebody's getting free, you know what I'm saying, like from prison, uh, yeah, I feel like that um, they possibly are still going to have, you know, a tough time trying to, you know what I'm saying, figure out uh, the next steps to move forward. Mm -hmm. I feel like, yeah, whoever these people are, these jackasses. Uh, I feel like that they, yeah, they're for for forever. For excuse me, I don't know why I just said forever, but for a long time, these people are gonna, you know, what I'm saying they're gonna be like, how did they get free? You know what I'm saying? How did this happen? You know what I mean? How did um this 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 divine counterpart, this divine masculine or divine feminine or this twin flame get free? You know what I'm saying? I feel like that yeah, there are gonna be some people that are gonna want to ask some questions. You know what I'm saying? Like. Uh, what did you use? You know what I'm saying? How did you do it? Um, did you wink your eye two times and, and twinkle your nose? Um, did you pull on your earlobe and rub your belly and pat your stomach five times? How did you do it? How did you free yourself and how did you... Yeah, because I feel like whoever's resonating with this message, you stand obedient. You know what I'm saying? You, you know what I'm saying, following the agenda definitely could have something to do with freeing a divine counterpart or helping a divine counterpart becoming free. You know what I'm saying? And this could be, you know, spiritually, physically, or both. I feel like uh, I'm almost feeling like that, yeah, if somebody is physically locked up, um, them being free spiritually definitely will help them to physically get become free as well. And so, yeah, I feel like people are going to be like, how'd you do it? What'd you say? You know what I'm saying? Did you say abracadabra or did you say freedom? What did you do? What did you say? And I feel like you're going to be like, I don't know what you talk about, Willis. Yeah, because cause the game is to be uh, sold, not to be told. You know what I'm saying? And the fact of the matter is, yeah, it's not for these people to know. And I'm also picking up, too, that, yeah, um, you don't really know. You know what I'm saying? It's it's just within you. You you know what you don't know. You know what I'm saying? Because, yeah, I feel like that whoever's resonating with this message, um, you don't know how powerful you are. And that's crazy. So whoever's resonating with this message, I feel like that, yeah, I feel like that you possibly do know yourself, you know what I'm saying? But you possibly need to, you know what I'm saying, go and spend some more time with yourself, you know what I'm saying? Maybe take yourself up on that mountain, you know what I'm saying? Uh, take yourself on a hike or whatever, you know what I'm saying? And you and you have a conversation with you. Um, because, yeah, I feel like that whoever's resonating with this message, you don't even know how powerful you are. But you're possibly about to find out because that's a part of the victory is what I'm picking up. I feel like I'm also picking up too that yeah you're gonna see how powerful you are because yeah the inevitable is happening so whatever is getting ready to take place yeah it definitely could be something like yeah a miracle you know what I'm saying um, 
I, I did pick up on prophecy, so something about a prophecy could be being fulfilled, whatever that is, you know what I'm saying? Um, something is going to take place to where your whoever's resonating with this message is going to be like, wow, Jesus loves me that much, you know what I'm saying? God loves me that much to give me all of this, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and this could literally be spiritual, you know what I'm saying? This could be physical or both. And so with that being said, yeah, this definitely could have something to do with a spiritual, physical upgrade, spiritual, physical uh, uh inheritance uh you know what i'm saying uh yeah so this 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 being free you know what i'm saying somebody's divine counterpart to inflame being free could be a part of yeah a, a spiritual inheritance but of course yeah it can manifest on the physical mm -hmm. but it's something about yeah what what somebody or some people thought that would never happen so yeah uh, who are resonating with this message being free you know what i'm saying point blank in a sense and citizens and period you know what I'm saying? A divine counterpart or a twin flame being free spiritually and physically. Um, these people being defeated. You know what I'm saying? When they thought that they weren't going to be defeated because they had about, yeah, 8, 10, 12 people. You know what I'm saying? Uh, coming against basically, you know what I'm saying? Two divine counterparts. But one divine counterpart, I feel like, yeah, they were bound with these people or or chained to these people. Or, you know what I'm saying? These people, yeah, was holding uh, uh, this divine counterpart, this twin flame hostage. Be aware, yeah, of a physical hostage situation, but I feel like the, yeah, there, yeah, spiritual warfare, you know what I'm saying, uh, has, has basically, you know what I'm saying, it's about to come to an end. The ceasefire is over, but yeah, I feel like that, uh, these people have ran out of ammo, and I feel like whoever's resonating with this message, you ain't even dipped into your ammo stash. You know what I'm saying? You still got 19 and a half warehouses full of ammo. You only use half of a warehouse of ammo. Yeah. And so I feel like, yeah, um, on the physical side, whoever's resonating with this message, I feel like the yeah, these people if they they're already feeling like jackasses, it's because a lot of things are taking place in their lives. Um, but those that make it through, you know what I'm saying, the things that are going on in their lives, I feel like that um yeah, that these people are gonna have to continue to watch victory over and over and over again. For as long as these people, you know what I'm saying, was was uh coming against um, you know what I'm saying, uh two divine counterparts, two twin flames or whatever, is as long as, you know what I'm saying, these people are gonna have to go through um whatever that it is that they're going through. You know what I'm saying? This could be I just heard seven years of bad luck. I don't believe in bad luck, but I do believe in karma. So yeah, seven years of karma or seven years of bad luck for those that believe it. You know what I'm saying? Uh Yeah. You know what I'm saying? These people could have to watch their kids be bullied or, you know what I'm saying, which is sad. Uh, or they could be, you know what I'm saying, their kids could turn into bullies, you know what I'm saying, which is sad. Uh, yeah, again, I definitely was picking up on, yeah, people's kids, you know what I'm saying, getting out of hand. Uh, you know what I'm saying, uh, having to stand up in front of a judge and not for good things. Um, mm -hmm. Wow. Wow, I like this message. Even though it's talking about spiritual warfare, I still like it. Because victory is, is yours. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like the, yeah, you humble. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's not like you're, you're, you know what I'm saying, walking around like, uh, yeah, I got the victory. I'm the winner. No. And I, and I don't feel like that you're going to walk around like that. Um, I don't feel like that, yeah, you've ever walked around. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm not picking up that energy. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like, yeah, don't she look kind of quirky? You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know what they're talking about. You know what I'm saying? What What do you mean? Uh, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like, I feel like that whoever is resonating with this message, you're the type of person that would put like, you know what I'm saying, uh, uh, a bouquet of roses, you know what I'm saying, and, and, a and a box of chocolate, you know what I'm saying, on somebody's doorstep. Just because somebody, you know what I'm saying, showed you some... some uh, uh, showed you um some kindness you know what i'm saying and you're like yeah i want to show them some kindness back but you don't even put your name on it you know what i'm saying you just put it in front of their door ring their doorbell and run you know what i'm saying um and then somebody comes out and it's like oh my god this is so nice this is so beautiful but who did this you know what i mean and then you see that person uh the next day you know this could be you know like uh somebody uh somebody just say a co-worker you know what i'm saying and then you could go to work the next day and uh, the coworker could be like, y'all know the greatest thing that happened. One of the greatest things that happened to me yesterday was, yeah, I 
somebody rang my doorbell and I opened the door and it was a big bouquet of uh, roses and you know what I'm saying a box of chocolates and it wasn't a name or anything and I wish I could I wish I knew who did it because I mean that was just so nice and and that person didn't even know that I was having a, the one of the worst days of my life and woo woo yada yada and then this is you well I wonder who did it you know what I'm saying? I wonder who did that. That was so nice, you know? Um, and then, yeah, you give that person a hug and, and be like, yeah, I hope your day is better than it was yesterday. You know what I'm saying? Not even disclosing that you were the one that put the roses and the, 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 the chocolates, you know what I'm saying, in, on their doorstep. Or, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. Or who else resonate with this message, you could be like me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I have a stash, you know what I'm saying, of, of uh, ones you know what I'm saying, in my car, um, and so, yeah, when I'm out and about, and it's, and it's for a reason, when I'm out and about, when I see homeless people, you know what I'm saying, and if they have their signs or whatever, or, you know, out, or, you know what I'm saying, if I know that they're homeless, that's why I have that stash of ones, so that I can at least, you know what I'm saying, help somebody to get some water and a sandwich, you know what I'm saying, at least I know that they, you know what I'm saying, hydrated, and they had something on their stomach for the day, you know what I mean, um, and I don't go around telling people, yeah, I got the stash in my, in my car, you know what I'm saying, uh, to give to the homeless people, you know. I mean, it's not a lot, you know, and I, when it gets low, I add to it, but you know what I'm saying, it's not a lot, because, yeah, I don't want nobody trying to run up, trying to, uh, you know what I'm saying, trying to rob me or whatever, yeah, run up, get done up, uh, but, <laughs> nah, but, uh, yeah. But nobody will never know, you know what I'm saying? I don't tell people, like, yeah, I got that stash in there, and I give to the homeless people, because, yeah, uh, I want to get my blessings, no. Um, the promises are the promises, you know what I'm saying? If we are selfless people, you know what I'm saying, uh, then, then that's the energy that we get back, you know what I'm saying? If we, yeah, yeah, if we, whatever we put out into the universe, we get it back. That's another reason why um, whoever's resonating with this message, you know what I'm saying, has a lot within them. I feel like whoever's resonating with this message, you've had a lot within you since you were born. And it's something about, yeah, how you were born or, you know what I'm saying, the, the life that you were born into. So whoever's resonating with this message, you possibly wasn't born into, you know what I'm saying, a, a stable, sturdy life. You know what I'm saying? When As far as your household. And so I feel like that, yeah, you definitely could have had a, you know what I'm saying, a, yeah. You were, you were dealt the card, you know what I'm saying? You were de dealt the cards that you... The cards that you were dealt, you know what I'm saying? You basically used them, you know what I'm saying, uh, to to and to your advantage, if that makes any sense. Yeah, you didn't, I feel like that uh, you didn't force anything, you know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like, yeah, you didn't force people to, to, to give you stuff. Or you didn't force, you know what I'm saying? Like if your parents, you know what I'm saying, weren't, uh, they were present, but they weren't present, if that makes sense. Yeah, you didn't force your parents or, you know what I'm saying, you didn't act out, you know what I'm saying, to get attention, you know what I'm saying, to force them to be present. I feel like that, yeah, you found other ways, you know what I'm saying? So you could have found like your friends, you know what I'm saying, and their parents are present, you know what I'm saying? And so, yeah, you could have latched on to your friends parents in order for you to, you know what I'm saying, uh, have a present adult in your life or, you know what I'm saying, and, and whatever, basically whatever took place in your life, you didn't let it hold you down, you know what I'm saying, I feel like that, yeah, you used it to your advantage, you know what I'm saying, whether it be good or bad, you know what I'm saying, you learned at a younger, at a young age how to take the good with the good and the bad with the bad or the bad with the good, the good with the bad, you know what I'm saying, you learned how to, you know what I'm saying, not allow the good outweigh the bad, the bad outweigh the good, you, you learned how to balance make sure that the good and bad was balanced out, you know what I'm saying, in your life, you know what I'm saying, and I feel like that, yeah, that's, that's why you're so strong, um, but again, I feel like that whoever's resonating with this message, you don't even know how strong you are, but I feel like, yeah, you're going to find out, and I feel like it's going to shock you, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I feel like that, yeah, you're going to have, um, uh, a moment, and I feel like it's it's kind of like yeah, and you you could already be having like a, on top of the 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 world moment. But I feel like that uh, if that's the case, then you have no idea. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what your next on top of the world moment is getting ready to feel like? Yeah, I don't feel like that you've had a victory like this before. You definitely could have had many victories in your life. You know what I'm saying? You could also had many losses in your life. We win some, we lose some. You know what I'm saying? But we live to fight another day. Um, but I feel like that, yeah, this victory, you know what I'm saying, this on top of the world moment, I feel like that, yeah, you ain't had one of these. And yeah, all the jackasses, that's exactly what they going, hee-haw, hee-haw. Yeah, they really going to feel like, and these, you know what I'm saying, these could be, yeah, 
Um, people, uh, they came against you, you know what I'm saying? People that, yeah, used the devil to come against you or people that said that you was the devil, you know what I'm saying? To get other people to come against you. Um, these could be, yeah, ex, ex lovers, you know what I'm saying? That, uh, that doubted that you, you know what I'm saying? Was, uh, the whole package or doubted that you was the tools and the toolbox, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. There's a lot of people that, yeah, already feel like jackasses, but they're going to, yeah, really feel like jackasses because, yeah, um, if you haven't met your twin flame or your divine counterpart, yeah, you're definitely going to come in contact with them, you know, for those that haven't met them. Uh, for those of you that have, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, they could be uh, reuniting, you know what I'm saying? Wow. Yeah, and I do feel like the people are going to be like, yeah, how'd you do it? What's your secret? Ain't no secret. It's called faith. It's called, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, trusting in your intuition, listening to your intuition. It, but, I mean, it, it is a secret. I ain't going to lie. You know what I'm saying? And everybody has their own secret. Everybody has their own uh, relationship. Everybody, but the promises remain the same, if that makes sense. For everybody, you know what I'm saying? That that, that walks the, the, the talk. You know what I'm saying? That talks the talk and walks the walk. You know what I'm saying? In, in the name of Jesus. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Under God. So, with that being said, yeah, um, there is a secret. And so, yeah, shh, keep it to yourself. <laughs> keep it to yourself. I'm also picking up, too, that, like, somebody could just, like, yeah, pull a disappearing act. You know what I'm saying? And nobody knows where somebody, you know what I'm saying, has went. But the fact of the matter is, yeah, something is, yeah, somebody's whereabouts is going to be kept a secret. Protective custody is what I just heard. So, I don't know. Somebody definitely could be, yeah, in protective custody or going to protective custody or something about protective custody is, is, is relevant. And it's something about a house. Somebody, yeah, definitely could be getting a new house or something about a house uh, needing a lot of work on it. Mm hmm. We got the float card in the reverse, so yeah. Something could happen to somebody's mother or somebody's baby mother. Mm -hmm. I feel like, yeah, something definitely could happen. So the inevitable, whatever the inevitable is, it's happening. And so, yeah, um, now somebody wants to listen. You know what I'm saying? Or that's when people are going to want to listen to, you know, what somebody has to say here. Um, and it definitely could have something to do with the truth or it definitely could have something to do, you know what I'm saying? When, when it comes to, you know what I'm saying? Like God and you know what I'm saying? Jesus or whatever the situation is. Yeah. How do we save ourselves? How do we get on this spiritual journey? How, you know what I'm saying? What do we do? You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. But there, there definitely could be multiple people, you know what I'm saying? Who, yeah, the jackasses who are going to be like, yeah, when something happens, whatever the inevitable is, it's going to happen. Or that is already happening, you know what I'm saying? Uh, that's, yeah, going to end and it's possibly not going to be a good thing, um, you know, for somebody or some people. Yeah, people are going to be like, yeah, what do, what do we do? You know what I'm saying? How do we, you know what I'm saying? How do we get that power? You know what I'm saying? But I feel like that whoever these people are, they got to tap in on their own, you know what I mean? I feel like, yeah, you can lead a, you can lead a, a jackass to water, you can lead a donkey to water just like a horse, but you can't make them drink. Mm-hmm. So, wow. Yeah, I won't use those just yet. Yeah. Ballin'. We fly high, no lie, you know this. So yeah, whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you possibly, yeah. If you ain't balling now, you about to be balling for sure. And and, and and I'm talking about financially. You ain't gonna even know. You gonna be like, 
Where'd all, where'd all this money come from? Where 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 did all this come from? Yeah, because the ball is in your court. The ball been, been in your court. Yeah, you're you're the bald eagle. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, it's it's something about yeah you yeah soaring over your haters. You know what I mean? Wow, but the ball definitely is in your court. Um, but it's but but I feel like it's it's kind of still. You know what I'm saying? I feel like the yeah these people feel like jackasses because yeah they can see the balls in your court. But they're but they're definitely getting ready to you know what I'm saying feel like hee haw hee haw like really jack really jackasses yeah when 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 something takes place here this is wow this is wow this is wow. And and it's not just when I say something. Um, many things are getting ready to take place. Mhm. Mm uh, this is my Mary 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 Jane card, my Mary Juana card. Um, yeah, somebody feels like a jackass because they were using this to, to come against somebody in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Um, so with that being said, uh, somebody could have, you know what I'm saying, uh, thought that somebody possibly still smoked the Mary Juana, you know what I mean? Because I'm picking up on that somebody, yeah, they persevered through a lot. So somebody, yeah, stop smoking, stop drinking, stop eating unhealthy, you know what I'm saying? Go to the gym five times a week. Um, you know what I'm saying? Uh, don't do too much cussing anymore. You know what I'm saying? Tries to cleanse their energy as much as possible. Or they, you know what I'm saying? Uh, pray, you know, five times a day or whatever the situation is. Yeah, somebody has changed their life. Somebody's went through a big transformation. That's an, yeah. And that's, and that's another reason why somebody doesn't know how powerful they are because it takes a very strong, powerful, courageous person, uh, to do some things that whoever's resonating with this message has, has done. You know what I'm saying? To go through, uh, the things that whoever's resonating with this message has gone through. You know what I'm saying? Just in life in general, from when they were a child up until, you know, an adult. Yeah. Whoever's resonating with this message, they don't even know how they got through. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. God, Jesus, I feel like that. Yeah, that's what you're gonna have to tell people, or maybe that's what you're telling people, and they don't believe you. Um, so yeah, I guess Jesus is gonna have to show them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Jesus is like, oh, y'all don't believe that I'm a carpenter. You know what I'm saying? All right, well, let me go ahead and, bu and, and build this this spiritual house, and let me, um, you know what I'm saying? Let it allow it to manifest on the physical or this spiritual mansion, and let me allow it to manifest on the spiritual, so y'all can see, you know what I'm saying, that it's real. Yeah, when, and so when people see a house, they would, like a piece of land, that a house wasn't there last week, and then they go to it this week, and it's a big ass mansion there. I bet you they believe then, won't they? Um, it's something about yeah, people being made to be believers. But somebody definitely, yeah, was using um, the Mary Jean Wana to, you know what I'm saying, to come against somebody. Um, or somebody definitely, yeah, could be, um, uh, could get caught, you know what I'm saying, with a large amount of Mary Jean Wana. Mm-hmm. I'm also picking up, too, that, yeah, somebody's, somebody could be allergic to, like, corn. Um... Somebody definitely could, yeah, try some, try to do something to somebody that's allergic to corn. Put some corn in somebody's um, food, or put use corn oil to, you know, what I'm saying, cook somebody's food or something like that. Mhm. Mm I'm also picking up too that yeah, somebody feels like a jackass because they were stupid enough to believe, you know, what I'm saying that yeah. Mary G. Wanna gives you wings, you know what I'm saying? Like Red Bull gives you wings and people really possibly was drinking Red Bull to see if they could get rings. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, somebody thought that um Mary G. Wanna was gonna give them some type of skills or was gonna, you know what I'm saying, do something for them or something like that. It's something about, yeah, ammo. So I don't know what this person was trying to do with the Mary G. Wanna or you know what I'm saying, trying to use it against somebody, you know what I mean? But I feel like that, yeah, if they were trying to use it against somebody, that's old news. You know what I'm saying? Try something new, ho. 
but somebody definitely yeah could get caught you know what I'm saying um and it definitely has something to do with a large amount of Mary G. Wanna, you know somebody definitely could find something you know what I'm saying uh while they're uh while they're hiking or you know what I'm saying while they're walking or you know what I'm saying whatever they're doing you know what I mean I feel like somebody definitely could find something and it definitely could have something to do with an herb some type of herb whatever this herb is I feel like that somebody definitely could create something with this herb I mean it don't have to be Mary Juana you know what I'm saying um, it could be anything that, you know what I'm saying, could help to cure, you know what I'm saying, diseases, help to do, you know what I'm saying, because I did pick up on, like, invention energy the other day in one of the messages, so yeah, uh, this could be a new invention that somebody, you know what I'm saying, is has come up on, you know what I'm saying, or not an invention, but like, you know, somebody could find, you know, while they're up in the mountains, or while they're, you know what I'm saying, uh, traveling, hiking, biking, uh, rock climbing, whatever, you know what I'm saying, somebody could come up on, you know what I'm saying, like something that possibly was supposed to be um, extinct, you know, like some type of plant or something that was supposed to be extinct, or you know what I'm saying, that people couldn't find, you know what I'm saying, uh, oh, for a lot of years, you know, maybe somebody's ancestors used whatever this is, and maybe somebody knows, I feel like somebody's indigenous out here, somebody's, yeah, has Native American uh, ancestors or something like that, um, but yeah, somebody could come up on something and yeah, turn nothing into something real quick. And people could be like, how'd you do it? Yeah. Why is the jackasses here? Yeah, this is in between. So yeah, they, they're they going to feel like jackasses because yeah, they, they done got in between some stuff. Uh, in between uh, two divine counterparts, you know what I'm saying? In between somebody's destiny and fate, or in between, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, I just heard a, a, a legal situation, court situation as well. I feel like, yeah, people feel like jackasses. It don't matter who they are because, yeah, they got in between some things and it definitely could be yeah two divine counterparts two twin flames you know what i'm saying a, a court situation a legal situation uh got between two parents trying to co-parent got between you know what i'm saying somebody trying to build a home or trying to build you know what i'm saying success for themselves trying to um yeah people feel like jackasses and they're and they're literally yeah they feel like jackasses now but they really are going to feel like jackasses once they see what's getting ready to take place mm-hmm yeah, and these people, yeah, because this is my stacks on stacks on stacks card, you know, like my racks on racks on racks. Yeah, stacks on stacks on stacks. So, yeah, these people, they're losing. Yeah, they done took, took a big loss. And it's something about a home. So, if somebody needed some repairs on a home or something like that, um, yeah, I feel like that people can't repair a home or people uh, put in a, a lot of money into something. And, yeah, they basically, yeah, it's a loss. They could have put a lot of money into a home, and yeah. Still didn't, you know what I'm saying, get anything from it. The house isn't, it still isn't fixed, or, you know what I'm saying, or somebody, yeah, could have done something to sabotage the house. You know what I'm saying? Somebody, yeah, has taken a big loss, or people have taken uh, big losses here because, yeah, of them getting in between. Again, getting in, but yeah, holding, you know what I'm saying, the divine counterpart hostage, you know, not physically, but y'all know what I'm saying, uh, keeping them stuck in the past, keeping them chained uh, to the past, yeah. It's giving me like that, yeah, that Shrek and Fiona energy. Mm hmm. Wow. Why's the tools here? Yeah. There goes another piece of the, 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 the toolbox. Wow. Somebody or people are trying to fix something now. But yeah, somebody done got in the middle of something and now, yeah, 
Uh, there are people that are, or people got in the middle of something. Now people are going crazy. You know what I'm saying? People are hooked. You know what I'm saying? On drugs and alcohol. Um, you know what I'm saying? People, yeah. Um, they're falling apart from the inside out. You know, people, yeah. Their mental health. You could be eating away at them, or yeah, they could be being attacked by their, uh, by their own demons. Their, their mental health, their physical health. You know, they could literally be getting attacked by their kids, and you know what I'm saying. All type of stuff here. So yeah, whoever these people are, now they're trying to fix it, or now they're trying to, you know what I'm saying, iron something out. They're trying to, yeah, see what, what, how do we do? What, what do we do? You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, we threw that axe over there. You know what I'm saying? We threw that. How do we? How do we? You know what I'm saying? Uh, say that we're sorry. Or how do we, you know what I'm saying, stop this from taking place? How do I get my lights turned back on? You know what I'm saying? How do I get my kids out of trouble? Uh, how do I, you know what I'm saying, uh, get such and such off the drugs and the alcohol? You know what I'm saying? When they never, you know what I'm saying, really indulge in drugs and alcohol, then all of a sudden, one day, they just, you know what I'm saying, start doing drugs and alcohol. And, and it's like that they've been doing drugs and alcohol for a very long time. Yeah. What is going on? How do we stop this? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. tractor so this is my tracker card so yeah i was picking up on yeah somebody working for it somebody doing something you know what i'm saying when it comes to uh, somebody's like electronic devices somebody definitely could yeah try to put a tracker on somebody's car but it didn't work or you know what i'm saying that was some type of plan that definitely didn't get fulfilled um somebody definitely is trying to track somebody I'm also picking up too that yeah if somebody is you know what i'm saying did pull some type of disappearing act yeah People are looking for, you know what I'm saying, um, somebody. There definitely could be a missing person, you know what I'm saying? So y'all be aware, um, there could be a missing person. This could be like, you know what I'm saying, somebody that's close to somebody. Mm -hmm. I'm also picking up too, yeah, just side note, like if there was somebody, you know what I'm saying, that like fell off the face of the earth, you know what I'm saying? This could be a celebrity or somebody of importance, you know, of high stature um, that they fell off the face of the earth and people was like, I wonder where such and such has been. I wonder where such and such has been. Yeah, that person is definitely going to resurface. But yeah, there are there's people that are tracking somebody, but they can't find somebody here. So these people definitely could be trying to track whoever's resonating with this message. Uh, there definitely could be a lot of people who could be trying to track um, whoever's resonating with this message on the internet. Trying to find, yeah. People can't find somebody. Wow. Why is this victory card here? We got the cracked egg here. Yeah. People are trying to fix uh, the mess, uh, clean up the mess that they made here. But yeah, people's eggs have been cracked. So people, yeah, uh, people have been exposed here. But it's something about exposure. I'm also picking up too that, yeah, people were trying to track somebody here so that they could, so whoever it is that they were trying to track could see that, yeah, they were trying to expose whoever they were trying to uh, track. So whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, people wanted you to see that they were trying to expose you or people wanted you to see, you know what I'm saying, that they, yeah, were trying to come against you on the internet and things of that nature. But I feel like, yeah, what you talking about, Willis? Do I look like I give a damn? You know what I'm saying? That's that's what I feel like uh, whoever's resonating with this message is, is on or feels, you know what I'm saying? Um, but I feel like, the, yeah, uh, it's something about... Um, yeah but this nut card and this egg card yeah it's giving me like the commercial uh this is your brain this is your brain on drugs any questions mm -hmm. somebody's kids yeah could be on drugs or something like that but it's something about yeah learning some lessons here as well so uh, whoever's resonating with this message, if you have kids, I feel like that, yeah, if you've, if you've, you know what I'm saying, instilled, you know what I'm saying, uh, some knowledge in your kids about what happens, you know what I'm saying, when you do drugs and things of that nature, yeah, I feel like that, uh, yeah, they're listening.
you know, but I mean, kids are kids. Teenagers are teen teenagers, you know what I'm saying? If you ain't living, you ain't learning. And so, yeah, of course, you know, kids, teenagers, they're going to, you know what I'm saying, experiment in, in things. It's just life, you know what I'm saying? But I feel like that, yeah, parents are great parents when they instill, you know what I'm saying, uh, the things that they are supposed to instill in their children. Because at the end of the day, regardless, us as humans, we, we every human has a rebellious, you know what I'm saying, a rebellious um, peace within them you know what i mean and so yeah everybody's been a kid before everybody's been teenagers before so yeah everybody knows how how it works so with that being said yeah kids are gonna be kids teenagers are gonna be key, teenagers mm -hmm. yeah I feel like that, yeah, there is somebody that is, or people, yeah, somebody's enemies that are getting attacked on the internet. Be aware, yeah, of, of, of your kids, you know what I'm saying, when it comes to the internet. Because um, I feel like that, yeah, there could be um, pedophiles, you know what I'm saying, that are literally, yeah, lurking on the internet um, when it comes to kids. But I'm also picking up, too, that, yeah, or these could be somebody else's kids, you know what I'm saying, like somebody's enemies' kids, somebody's adversaries' kids that literally could be being attacked because of their parents. Um, but these adversaries definitely could have attacked not only you, but they could have attacked your kids for those that have them, you know what I'm saying, in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Talking about the kids, you know what I'm saying, um, going to lurking on, you know, kids, social media pages, becoming stalkers, becoming, yeah, um, weird, you know what I'm saying, to the point to where, yeah, uh, these people could get in trouble for that, you know what I'm saying. But somebody, yeah, they're, they, they, they going crazy. And it definitely has something to do, yeah, with some drugs. Again, there's there's multiple things that are going on, you know, within amongst, you know what I'm saying, people. Again, somebody's using a, a flashlights and, and, and candles because, yeah, they can't afford to pay their electricity, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, somebody definitely could be, yeah, get, get so angry that they just bust out windows, bust out car windows, vandalize, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, somebody definitely could have vandalized a home. You know? That could be how uh, a home, you know what I'm saying, somebody put a lot of money into a home and, and yeah, they, they basically take took a big loss. Mm-hmm. Spiritual Journey, why is this here? Yep, and be aware, you know what I'm saying, because uh, somebody definitely, yeah, after, you know what I'm saying, some uh, an adversary, you know what I'm saying, that feeling like a jackass, you know what I'm saying, after they, yeah, have became the adversary, and after they, yeah, have attack, 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 come in and be like, yeah, we took a big loss, you know what I'm saying, everything is, is, is going haywire, whatever, um, you know, is there any way that we can, um, you know what I'm saying, borrow a couple of dollars, or is there any way, you know what I'm saying, that you can help us, you know what I'm saying, fix the windows on, on the car, or fix, you know what I'm saying, hell no, hell no, and I'm also picking up too, that yeah, there, there is somebody that definitely could be trying to fix, you know what I'm saying, some stuff, you know, it definitely could have something to do with exposure, it definitely could have something to do, you know what I'm saying, uh, yeah, with somebody's kids, uh, you know what I'm saying, with a pregnancy, or whatever the situation is, um, you know, it could just be exposure, somebody could be trying to fix it, you know, to come in and be like, yeah, well, you know, I know that I did that, but I, but I fixed it though, thinking that that's going to solve, you know what I'm saying, everything, no, it's 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 gotten bigger to the point to where yeah they the, the spiritual warfare they they started it yeah and 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 yeah Jesus the Jesus and the Most High is going to end it um, and victory belongs to whoever's resonating with this message yeah because you remain brave mm hmm yep. And so, yeah, I, I feel like that there are, there are people that are, yeah, wondering, like, how did they remain brave? How did they remain, you know what I'm saying, so, um, uh, so steadfast? How did they remain so, you know what I'm saying, uh, so focused? How did they remain so unmovable, unshakable, unbreakable, unbendable? Yeah. <laughs> and, yeah, whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, I feel like all you can tell them is, yeah, Jesus, God, who else? <laughs> Wow. 
Give me one more for the spiritual journey. Yeah, somebody's on a slippery slope. Somebody's name could be Rhonda. Mm -hmm. Somebody, yeah, definitely could like could bike or like to bike, bike ride, ride bikes, uh, hike, ride bikes. So yeah, somebody definitely um, is is connected to nature out here. Mm-hmm. I feel like, yeah, somebody's the whole package. You know what I'm saying? All the way down to, yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This is crazy. Somebody, yeah. If if somebody, you know what I'm saying, thinks that they can't get pregnant or, you know what I'm saying, ain't trying to get pregnant once, you know what I'm saying, two people come together. For those of you that want to come together with a divine counterpart or your twin flame, those that are on the twin flame journey, yeah, you better wear some protection. Because, yeah, you might just get pregnant. I'm also picking up, too, that, yeah, there is somebody in masculine energy who regrets the day that they decided to have sexual intercourse with somebody, you know what I'm saying, and possibly get them pregnant. Mm-hmm. If somebody, yeah, has a child or children, yeah, somebody that somebody definitely had a child or children with, you know what I'm saying, yeah, they, 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 they feel like there is many people that, yeah, by the end of whatever this is, yeah, there's multiple people that are going to feel like jackasses, but I feel like that they already do. Um, but once something takes place for somebody, yeah, it's a wrap. Yeah, it's that back then they didn't want you, now you hot, they all own you syndrome. Yeah, the Mike Jones effect. Somebody's name could be Mike, you know what I'm saying? Somebody's last name could be Jones. I'm also picking up too that yeah, if if somebody was to um was to uh you know get with somebody that they chose to get with their divine counterpart or their twin flame or whatever the situation is yeah there are going to be people you know what I'm saying they're going to be amazed because I'm really picking up that yeah somebody uh, whoever's resonating with this message you might not even know you know what I'm saying or you think um that your divine counterpart or your twin flame is this person but you're going to be amazed to find out that it's not this person that you've been thinking that it was you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. yeah you're gonna be like I, well i didn't know i thought it was joe i didn't know it was johnny or i thought it was jessica i didn't know it was jane you know what i'm saying and no offense to to joe or johnny jessica or jane i'm just using them as an example Somebody's, yeah, somebody's divine counterpart, definitely, you know, their initials could be JJ, you know what I'm saying? First, middle, last name could start with a J. Um, but yeah, this is my addiction card, but it's in the reverse. And so with that being said, yeah, how did you get off of drugs? Or how did you not, you know what I'm saying, get addicted? Or how did you, yeah. Mm-hmm. I feel like, yeah, there is somebody that's also in regret here as well. And it's because, yeah, they 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 were on drugs or something when something happened. You know what I'm saying? They could have been pregnant and something could have happened. You know what I mean? And, yeah, um, it was over with when it comes to, you know what I'm saying, the pregnancy. <sighs> yeah, attack, attack, attack. The adversary didn't, the, yeah, they didn't know what, what, what was going to hit them. You know what I'm saying? Uh, until it hit them. And I feel like it's hitting them. Yeah. But yeah, I feel like that there are a lot of people, you know what I'm saying, that are wondering, like, how did somebody do it? You know what I'm saying? How did somebody go from, you know what I'm saying, uh, uh, eating chips and cakes uh, every day, you know what I'm saying, to, to eating, you know what I'm saying, sub sandwiches and, and, and carrots and, and celery and, you know, strawberries and, and, and watermelon and cantaloupe and, you know what I'm saying, all those healthy things, you know, every day. How do they do that? You know what I'm saying? How do they fix their mental health? You know what I mean? Um, how do they get their, uh, keep their kids, you know, and, um, you know, uh, in, 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 in a straight line or, you know what I'm saying, how do they, you know, for the most part, how do they keep their kids in a straight line, you know what I mean? 
How did they even get on this spiritual journey? You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. How did this person, yeah, again, get off drugs? Or, you know what I'm saying? How is this person not addicted, you know what I'm saying, um, to drugs when, when their life has been a living hell or whatever the situation is? Yeah. I feel like that people didn't know somebody. They still don't know somebody. People don't know whoever's your name with this message and what whoever's your name with this message has really went through is what I'm picking up. They thought that they did. So, yeah. A lot of people, those people, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, they feeling like jackasses. Maybe these people are, yeah, if I, hearing somebody's story or, you know what I'm saying? Uh, hearing, you know, how somebody, what somebody has gone through in their life. And maybe they're feeling like a jackass. Maybe they're like, yeah, well, I see why, you know what I'm saying? That they're, that they're this way. I see why that they're strong. Or I see why, you know what I'm saying? They decided to get on their spiritual journey or whatever the situation is. Yeah, because we have the bookshelf in the reverse. This is uh, the information station. Mm -hmm. Whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you're filled with a lot of wisdom and knowledge. People want to know how you know, what you know, how you know, why you know. You know what I'm saying? How do you know that the grass is green? How do you know that the, the sky is blue? How do you know that the clouds are clouds? How do you know that a sandwich is a sandwich? You know what I'm saying? How do you know, you know what I'm saying, how to fix that car? How do you know how to change your oil? How do you know how to uh, change your tire? How do you know, you know what I'm saying, how to um, work a, a, a laptop? Or how do you know, you know what I'm saying, how to um, do things that IT people do, but you, you know what I'm saying, you're not in IT? How do you know? Yeah, wisdom and knowledge, baby. Wisdom and knowledge, isolation state, uh, excuse me. Information station isolate. So yeah, whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you could be, you could isolate yourself. You know what I'm saying? Or you're just isolated. You know what I'm saying? From people, places, and things that don't serve your highest good. But yeah, definitely filled with a lot of wisdom and knowledge. But it's something about books. You definitely could read a lot of books. Um, you definitely could be about to write books, or you're, uh, you know what I'm saying, a, a author, or you need to be. Mm-hmm. Somebody's name could be Madeline, Maybell. Peter. What's you talking about, Willis? Yeah, we got the comfortable car. And the reverse here. So, yeah, there's people that, yeah, they can't, they're not comfortable. They can't relax. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. Something about concentration. Yeah, people are like, yeah, how do they stay so focused? You know what I'm saying? How do they continue to stay focused on themselves and their kids and everything when, yeah, we were throwing every tool known to man, uh, you know what I'm saying, over their way. We were doing everything that we possibly could, you know what I'm saying, to, uh, to, 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 to take them off of their focus here. I'm also picking up, too, that, yeah, people are, are yeah, well, I feel like they ain't, they ain't feeling that way anymore. They're not going to feel that way anymore. They, yeah, they're going to be focused on their own selves. Because, yeah, they... Yeah. Because these people, yeah. Why don't you choose some beef and get some chicken instead? It's in the reverse. So, yeah. Ain't no beef. Somebody definitely could try to... Yeah, try to fix something. Yeah, that they done on the internet. Because we got the world card in the reverse. But, yeah. People's whole worlds are being turned upside down here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, while whoever's resonating with this message continues, yeah, to soar over their haters. Somebody definitely could see a bald eagle, you know what I'm saying, while they're biking or while they're hiking or whatever the situation is. So, with that being said, yeah, in whatever way, shape, form, or fashion, uh, these people, one and whoever's resonating with this message is life. Uh, uh, let me say that over. In whatever way, shape, form, or fashion that these people uh, wanted uh, whoever's life Whoever's resonating with these messages, your life to be uncomfortable. Yeah, these people are. All, yeah, they're uncomfortable right now in their lives, but they have no idea. You know what I'm saying? That that uncomfortability is about to get so uncomfortable. I'm also picking up too that yeah, there could be a lot of people that are scrunched up in one small ass house as well. Yeah, with the house at the bottom of the deck. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Can you give me something to eat? We got the sandwich right here. So something about a sandwich. A flower. So yeah, be aware of somebody trying to, yeah, uh, come in, you know what I'm saying? And like, yeah, um, I, I know that, you know what I'm saying, we did whatever we did. Or I know that they did whatever they did on the internet or whatever they were doing, you know what I'm saying? But I'm here to fix it or whatever. Um, but yeah, is there any way you can give me a sandwich, you know what I'm saying? If there is there anything that you can, you know what I'm saying, You can, can you help me? Or can you help us? Because I feel like, the, yeah, that's literally what people are going to want to ask is for some help. But I feel like that you've given, you've you've already given somebody something here, and it definitely has something to do with yeah, some tools, some information. You know what I'm saying? You definitely have given help. You yeah, this is like soul food sandwich with the tools. Yeah, soul food. So you are already giving people. You know what I'm saying? Some information to help them. But I feel like the yeah, whoever these people are, they took that information and was like, yeah, fuck you. Um, yeah, we're gonna go against you because we see that you're yeah, you're an adversary. You know what I'm saying? You're an op, you're an opponent. Um, but they yeah, when they should have looked at whoever's resonating with this message, like um, an ally. So somebody yeah, they deemed themselves as an adversary and an enemy and op. You know what I'm saying? When they should have been an ally. Mhm. Mm Yeah, we got the stove in the reverse here. Somebody can't cook? Yeah. Turn on the stove. Turn on the gas stove, please, but it's in the reverse. So, yeah, somebody's gas is off. Somebody's electricity is off. Somebody's gas. Yeah, something about a home. So something about, yeah, a home getting fixed. Or something about, yeah... A home can be fixed because, yeah, something definitely could have taken place. Somebody definitely could have forgotten to um, turn the gas off or something like that. You know what I'm saying? So people could have been working in a home or something like that. and Or that's literally could take place. And, yeah, a home could explode because they forgot to turn the gas off. Wow. Somebody possibly, yeah, somebody don't need to... Uh, Something about eggs as well. Somebody needs to stop eating eggs. Definitely messes with somebody's stomach. Mm -hmm. But I'm also picking up too that, yeah, somebody can't stand the heat. So they want to get their ass out of the kitchen. But it's something about, yeah, people either, um, people have lost their home, you know what I'm saying? and Or, you know what I'm saying? they Or they, uh, yeah, they put a, a lot of money into a home and something could have happened to the home or something's going to happen to the home. Or, the fact of the matter is, yeah, people just can't pay their bills. You know what I'm saying? They're strapped for cash and they can't pay their bills. Mm-hmm. It's something about an uncle. So, there's an uncle involved. Mm-mm. Yeah. Yeah, somebody can't cook. Uh definitely could have something. Yeah. I feel like that yeah, there are people that are going to have to and maybe it is. Maybe it's a lesson. You know what I'm saying? People are going to have to be humble. And basically, yeah, the same person, you know what I'm saying, that they deemed as an op, an adversary, an enemy, the same person that they attacked, attack, attack. Yeah, they're going to have to, yeah, bow down or be humble. You know what I'm saying? Let me not say bow down, but yeah. I feel like that whoever's resonating with this message, you possibly could have a choice. You know what I'm saying? Um, are you going to help these people or no? Because I feel like that, yeah, um, somebody in this situation, they're going to need some help. They're going to come and ask for some type of help. 
there are multiple people that are literally going to need some type of help in some way, shape, form, or fashion. But I feel like that, again, whoever's resonating with this message, you've already given something to these people. You've already given these people some type of wisdom and knowledge or you've given these people, you know what I'm saying, some type of advice. You, you've, you've already helped these people. And that's literally why, yeah, people feel like jackasses. Now they have to come back and ask for a sandwich after they refuse to feed you or after they refuse to give to you or after they refuse to help you to, you know what I'm saying, uh, fix fix your car. Now they come in ask for you know what i'm saying a wrench can i borrow a wrench uh you know what i'm saying uh yeah after they try to yeah put put fire under your ass yeah they're gonna want to come and ask you can you help me put the fire out can you help me turn the gas off or whatever the situation is but be aware yeah of somebody getting a new stove or something like that and somebody has gas and they don't turn the gas off because that will uh yeah spark a flame and it can cause yeah an explosion so be aware of that but that definitely could be something that takes place on the internet as far as like some type of explosion. So yeah, attack, attack, attack. With that being said, yeah. Whoever deemed themselves as the adversary, as the enemy, as the op, attack, attack, attack. Wow. Yep. On the back of the card, it says they are building a house. Mm -hmm. if, if something happened in the past, like if that took place, like, yeah, there was, you know what I'm saying, uh, people, uh, you know what I'm saying, a house built or whatever the situation is, and, um, uh, and like, you know what I'm saying? People were, you know, putting in, you know, the, the, uh, the refrigerators and the, you know what I'm saying? The toilets and you know what I'm saying? The necessities or whatever. Um, and yeah, they put in the stove and it didn't, uh, and they didn't turn off the gas and it, and if it blew up, I feel like, yeah, something, something, somebody could be getting some type of blessing all the way from when that took place. I feel like it's when, yeah, somebody was a kid. You know what I'm saying? So something could have taken place when somebody was a kid. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like that whatever took place when somebody was a kid, you know, cause I, but I feel like that the many things took place when somebody was a kid. That's why somebody is as strong as the as they are. Um, but with, with whatever this is, I feel like that, yeah, somebody is getting a blessing, you know what I'm saying, from something uh, from way back when they were a kid is what I'm picking up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It definitely has something to do with, yeah, building a, a legacy or, you know what I'm saying, building generational wealth as well. So whatever, yeah, so this could have something to do with uh, somebody's ancestors, you know what I'm saying, whether they're, you know what I'm saying, those that uh, uh, could be passed away. But also, like, you know what I'm saying, the elders, like, yeah, let me call them the elders. So somebody's elder could still be alive, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like that uh, somebody is getting ready to receive something from their elder that's still alive, you know what I mean? Uh, or it's something about, yeah, somebody being put in somebody's will and they don't even know it as well as what I'm picking up. So again, the spiritual uh, inheritance definitely can manifest on the physical, for sure. Wow, people, you know what I'm saying, that... um. Uh, while people that um, you know what I'm saying, deem themselves as adversaries, enemies, ops, or whatever, yeah, they're living, they're going to live in the most uncomfortable um time of their life that they've ever experienced here. Mm -hmm. I'm also picking up too that yeah, somebody definitely could be um trying to uh yeah get on their spiritual journey, so somebody definitely could have awakened. You know what I'm saying? Spiritually awakened. And if somebody was addicted, they're possibly, yeah, trying to, you know what I'm saying, uh, get off of whatever they were addicted to or, you know what I'm saying, stop doing whatever they, you know what I'm saying, were addicted to. Um, but it definitely could be uncomfortable. And, yeah, people could be like, how, you know what I'm saying, uh, how did uh, such and such stop eating those chips and cookies every day? That was an addiction. They eat it, ate it five times a day. How did they just stop all of a sudden? Yeah, I feel like that uh, people literally could be wondering how something or things 
have taken place in whoever's resonating with this messenger's life. And I feel like all you can tell them is God. You know what I'm saying? Jesus. Like, whether they believe you or not, yeah. But I feel like that, with that being said, that's literally what you could have told people, you know what I'm saying, uh, for many, many years, you know what I'm saying, when things happen, you know, it could have been when you were a kid all the way up until adult, you know. Why did that house blow up? Because God said it was going to blow up so that we could get a new home or, you know what I'm saying, whatever the situation is. I feel like that, yeah, um, there are people that are getting ready to be made believers. So with that being said, if if people, if, if who are judging with this message, you know what I'm saying? I always said, you know, when people was like, well, how did that happen? God. And they could have been like, I wish you would stop saying God. I wish you would stop saying Jesus. Like, oh my, it's just so annoying. Um, yeah, I feel like the people are really going to see something take place and they going to know that it, that it's nobody but, but God, nobody but Jesus. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like it, it literally could be. In whoever's resonating with this message. So like, yeah, you, you know what I'm saying? Getting over whatever addictions that you are getting over, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and doing it in a comfortable way. Yeah. Not, not struggling, not fighting, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just stopping eating the chips and the cakes, you know what I'm saying? Abruptly. Or, you know what I'm saying? Stop smoking the cigarettes abruptly. Or stop, you know what I'm saying? Eating unhealthy things abruptly. Or stop, yeah, eating stuff that, um, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Building generational wealth um, and, and, and doing it in a comfortable way. Yeah, I feel like the people are like, what the hell? But I'm also picking up too that, yeah, something else is going to put the icing on the cake. Something, yeah, take away in the reverse. So, yeah, whatever, whatever is it in you, it's in you. Can't nobody take it away. Mm hmm. Whatever this victory is that you're getting ready to receive, can't nobody take it away. Whatever this spiritual or physical inheritance is, can't nobody take it away. Yeah, this this divine counterpart, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's This twin flame situation, yeah, they can't take it away because it's a spiritual connection. So regardless if two people never come together, there's still a connection between two people. Um, but it's something about, yeah... Somebody can't overcome something here. Somebody can't overcome, you know what I'm saying? Or it's getting harder and harder for somebody to overcome something. It could be their addictions. It could be, you know what I'm saying, facing their own demons. It could be, yeah, um, them being attacked by their mental or by their physical or whatever the situation is. Yeah, somebody can't um, overcome something here. And so, yeah. Wow. Or people can't. And yeah, they can no longer keep it covered up, no longer keep whatever is going on hidden, no longer can keep, you know what I'm saying, the the MO that they were that they were throwing, they can no longer keep it hidden, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. And this is my cleansing card. Somebody's name could be Chantel. Somebody could be from Australia, or Australia could be significant. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you could be seeing the the angel number three three three. Yeah, alignment. So whoever is resonating with this message, yeah, your mind, body, and spirit, you know what I'm saying, is, is definitely in alignment, you know what I'm saying, because, yeah, you choose the clean, not the dirty, you choose, yeah, uh, spiritual enlightenment, not, you know what I'm saying, uh, darkness, um, but yeah, whoever's resonating with this message, you definitely um, uh, would benefit, you know, when it comes to... Uh, cleansing your energy but i feel like the yeah you're the type of person that yeah you are cleanse your energy every day just because you know what i'm saying you like clean fresh energy mm -hmm. but it's something about yeah people wondering how you stay clean you know what i'm saying how you you know what i'm saying continue to be on your spiritual journey how you continue you know what i'm saying to walk strongly and proudly you know what i'm saying how you continue to be obedient you know what i'm saying when you say that you're not gonna eat them chips and cake you don't eat them chips and cake you know what i'm saying if you say that you ain't gonna eat them eggs you don't eat them eggs you know what i'm saying uh yeah but be aware, yeah, people, you know what I'm saying, coming in like, yeah, um, I do feel like a jackass, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I know that I didn't even give you a crumb, you know what I'm saying, of a piece of bread, a crumb, a cracker crumb, a chip crumb, a no crumb. But you you think you got a sandwich for me, you know what I'm saying, or whatever the situation is. But I'm also picking up, too, that, yeah, um, I feel like that whoever's just name with this message, 
you definitely, yeah, have given a lot of wisdom and knowledge to a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? And they, and, and yeah, some of those people, they definitely took the wisdom and knowledge, you know what I'm saying? And, 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 and said, fuck you. But those, but some other people, yeah, they took the wisdom and knowledge that you gave to them and they, yeah, they used it. Um, I feel like that, yeah, your kids are, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I feel like that, yeah. There is somebody that's mirroring you, and so it could be a divine counterpart. Yeah, a twin flame as well. So, wow. Or or this could be, you know what I'm saying, because of the spiritual connection. Yeah, that's that energy. So, you definitely could have projected that good positive energy over to that divine counterpart, over to that um, a twin flame. And so, that's why I was picking up the energy that, like, yeah. It could come a time where two people do come together for those of you that want that. You know what I'm saying? Everybody has free will. I'm also picking up, too, that, yeah, somebody feels like a jackass because they did give, you know what I'm saying, somebody or some people, you know what I'm saying, like some, some ammo. So they gave them, yeah, uh, some information, you know what I'm saying, to use against somebody or whatever the situation is. But I feel like it didn't matter. You know what I'm saying? It's The victory still belongs to whoever's resonating with this message. I feel like that everything is backfiring on these people anyway because they should have minded their business. They should have stayed in their place and ran their race. They should have worried about, you know what I'm saying, their gas and their electricity and their water, you know what I'm saying? They should have worried about, you know what I'm saying, their kids and their lives, their sanity, you know what I'm saying? What they got going on, their addictions that they need to overcome, you know what I'm saying? Uh, them living a more cleaner life every day, you know what I'm saying? A more sober life every day, a more healthier life every day. That's what those people should have been, you know what I'm saying, worried about. Mm -hmm. Whoever's name with this message, yeah, you're possibly um, being asked to have some type of empathy here. Empathy is the ability to understand and share the feelings of others. And so, yeah, maybe you, you already know that. You know what I'm saying? Maybe you already know that. And maybe you already do have some type of empathy or compassion, you know what I'm saying, uh, for these people. You know what I'm saying? If you know who these people are. Because I feel like to some people, you don't even know who they are. They do. They random people. Or they're people that you don't know that, that people that you know got people that you don't know involved in some stuff. Um, but there definitely was some, some type of evidence that was found here. So, yeah, somebody is guilty. So... I just saw a sister, so th there definitely could be a sister that's involved. We got a, a Scorpio Sagittarius Cusper, so you could be a Scorpio Sagittarius Cusper, or there's a Scorpio Sagittarius Cusper involved. Somebody yeah, is, is is feeling like a jackass and somebody also realizes that, yeah, time is the wisest counselor of all. Um, so, yeah, there definitely could have been a lot of time that has passed here when it comes to, like, communication with some of these people that, yeah, uh, deem themselves as adversaries, enemies, ops, you know what I'm saying? That, yeah, attack, attack, attack. Something definitely could happen uh, within the next 30 days. People are going to feel like jackasses, more of jackasses, you know what I'm saying, in the next 30 days. Mm -hmm. And it's something about an innocent bystander. So something could happen to an innocent bystander here. Or whoever tries to name with this message, you was just an innocent bystander. Uh, you know what I'm saying? When, when, when these people decided to attack, attack, attack. You could be seeing the angel number 7777. Seven. <laughs> or you could be seeing, yeah, the angel number 777. Uh, once the challenge your authority came out, so be aware, because within the next thirty days, yeah, somebody could be trying to challenge your authority, or maybe that's what some some people already done. You know what I'm saying? And that's why, yeah, they're definitely getting ready to be made into believers here. 
Mm -hmm. But just be aware, because I am picking up that, yeah, uh, people definitely are going to um, uh, come in, you know what I'm saying, for different reasons. They're trying to communicate for different reasons, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We got airy season. Uh, so something could have taken place during airy season. Airy season was March the 21st to April 19th. Um, somebody could be in Aries. Mm -hmm. Somebody has a, a limited worldview here. They're not open to um, broadening their horizons. So with that being said, yeah, that could be uh, who wants to try to challenge somebody's authority or somebody has already tried to challenge somebody's authority. And so, yeah, somebody is going to be proven, you know what I'm saying, to be um, the, the authority. You know what I'm saying? Somebody, yeah, whoever's resonating with this message, you're going to be proven to be the authority. You're going to be proven to be right. You're going to be proven, yeah, and it definitely has something to do with, with Jesus and God. You know what I'm saying? So whatever uh, somebody is trying to challenge your authority about, I feel like the, yeah, somebody was like, well, how'd you do that? You told him, God, Jesus. How how did you get through that? God, Jesus. Yeah. And I feel like people was like, oh, I wish that they would just, yeah, no, you shut up. Because the fact of the matter is, it is true. Whoever's resonating with this message, you've gotten through your life because of Jesus and because of God, because of your belief. You know what I'm saying? Because of your faith. It don't matter if you're a child or if you're an adult. You know what I mean? And to keep it uh, real, yeah, kids have more faith than adults. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, people want to come in and challenge your authority, but I thought that they ain't going to get, um, they ain't going to, uh, you get to challenge your authority because it's going to be because something is going to be shown uh in, in to these people you know what i'm saying or something is going to happen you know what i'm saying uh to where these people are going to have to yeah believe that yeah it's jesus it's god yeah we got an air sign libra gemini aquarius so you could be an air sign libra gemini aquarius um but yeah i feel like people possibly um could be could say that you're arrogant whoever's just name with this message and it definitely could be because they want another answer. They want a different answer. They don't want to keep hearing God. They don't want to keep hearing Jesus. But that is your answer. That is your truth. Your whole truth and nothing but the truth. You know what I'm saying? That is your final answer. Yeah, people think it's something else. You know what I'm saying? So people, yeah, they could think it's magic. Or they could think that, yeah, you you say abracadabra and it happens. Or whatever the situation is. No, but you're not arrogant. You're confident. You're confident that, yeah, it's Jesus, it's God. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But again, these whoever this is or these people, they have a limited worldview. You know what I'm saying? Um, so they don't, they don't, maybe these people ain't went through nothing. Or, you know what I'm saying? Maybe these people just don't believe. Um, I don't know. So with that being said, if they don't believe, uh, they're definitely getting ready to be made into believers. Um, in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Or in many ways, shapes, forms, and fashions. Yeah. Somebody is being removed from a high position. So if that's the person that wants to challenge your authority, yeah, they're being removed from a, a high position here. Or 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 somebody could have already tried to challenge your authority and they're finding out that, yeah, who, who is the authority? It ain't them. Mm-hmm. It, it definitely could be somebody that works in IT, somebody that, you know what I'm saying, works, you know what I'm saying, uh, for like a plat social media platform or, you know what I'm saying, work for internet in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow. Somebody's hidden pain is coming to the surface as well. So I feel like it's whoever this is that, yeah, thought that they could challenge your authority only to find out that, yeah, you're, you outrank them. Um, but it's something about, yeah, within the next 30 days, a lot of stuff is getting ready to take place. Yeah, the inevitable. Um, a lot of inevitable things are going to take place. Yeah, I feel like that they're faded events. Mm-hmm. I feel like that there's a lot of people, you know what I'm saying, that were hiding pain, um, and it's coming to the surface, you know, and I feel like that, yeah, 
Um, there could be somebody that, yeah, goes on after they, you know, what I'm saying? And, and, a, and a part of the reason why is somebody is being removed from a high position because, yeah, they possibly, yeah, shared some information that they weren't supposed to share or they were, you know, what I'm saying on the Internet doing some things that they weren't supposed to be doing. I feel like, yeah, somebody or some people invaded privacy as well. Um, I feel like the, yeah. Whoever this is that's being removed from a high position, yeah, their pain is hidden pain is coming to the surface. Um, their childhood wounds could be manifesting, you know what I'm saying, on the physical. Um, uh, multiple people, whoever, you know what I'm saying, deem themselves as adversaries, enemies, ops, whatever they want to call themselves, haters. Yeah. I'm also picking up, too, that, yeah, whatever's getting ready to take place for somebody here. Um, somebody's going to think that it's good, too good to be true here. Mm-hmm. Somebody's divine counterpart, you know what I'm saying? Somebody's twin flame, you know what I'm saying? If they are locked up, you know what I'm saying, in jail or prison, like physical, yeah, they could think that it's too good to be true. How did I get free? Or whatever the situation is. Or, you know what I'm saying? Uh whatever is getting ready to take place as far as this victory for whoever's just name with this message, yeah. Um You're possibly gonna think it's too good to be true, but you know it's true because you know, you know what I'm saying, who did it or who gave it yeah jesus god uh but there's also other people you know what i'm saying that's getting ready to watch something and they're gonna be like oh my god so it is true it is jesus it is god like <laughs> yeah mm -hmm. and it's something about yeah people that didn't support you your dreams in the past are gonna have to watch you live them because, yeah, whoever's resonating with this message, you definitely are protected by your ancestors. And so, with that being said, yeah, um, going back to, yeah, the past, something about the past. So, with that being said, yeah, if the house, you know what I'm saying, blew up and it was 20 people in the home, everybody in that home got out. And it was because, yeah, somebody's ancestors were protecting, you know what I'm saying, a whole family of people. You know what I mean? And so, maybe that's when somebody really knew, like, yeah, Jesus is real. And somebody was a kid, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you could tell people about your ancestors. That's showing gratitude, you know what I'm saying? Just like you could tell people about the, the you know what I'm saying, the goodness of Jesus, the goodness of God. You know what I'm saying? That's showing gratitude. Um, but maybe people was like, I wish the hell they would shut up. All right. Yeah. All right. Because, yeah, it's the takeover. So... Whoever's resonating with this message, you possibly about to take over something. Or, yeah, um, something is getting ready to take place here, yeah. Because whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you need to say goodbye to your old life. Or that's what you're getting ready to do in the next 30 days. Uh, somebody's divine counterpart, somebody's twin flame could be saying goodbye to their old life. Wow. And something about, yeah, legal representative. So with that being said, in the next 30 days, a legal representative um, could be reaching out to somebody, but there's also a legal representative that could be being removed from a high position. So there was a legal uh, representative that was involved in some stuff, and we did see that evidence was found. And so, yeah. Definitely a legal situation uh, taking place. And this innocent bystander card keeps reappearing. So it's something about, yeah, an innocent bystander. Whoever's resonating with this message, just know within the next 30 days, um, there is some truth and clarity that is coming um, your way. And it's basically to assist you in making some type of decision here. Mm -hmm. So yeah, give, give, something is going to be given, some truth and clarity um, to help you to fix something here. Yeah, but somebody definitely, or people definitely thought that they were going to put your, uh, you know what I'm saying, that were going to put your fire out or whatever the situation is. And no boo, no boo, no boo. You could be seeing the angel number 211. Yeah, that's the spiritual helpline. And your angels are here to assist you 24-7, seven days a week. So with that being said, yeah. Um, this truth and clarity definitely could be coming from, yeah, your, your, your guardian angels. Mm -hmm. 
I feel like somebody or people are going to be are going to feel left behind here um, when it comes to something here. But I feel like that it doesn't matter. This is this is yeah destined and fated to to happen. You know what I'm saying? All these events that are going to take place or are already taking place, yeah, they're fated to happen. These fated events are leading up to you know what I'm saying something that yeah a lot of people are going to be like yeah it's too good to be true. How did that happen? How did they go from you know what I'm saying just uh, working a nine to five you know what I'm saying to being a multimillionaire like overnight? Yeah, but they're going to know it's it, how who how else could it happen? You know what I'm saying? Somebody didn't win the lottery. Somebody you know what I'm saying it was just destined and fated. Yeah, somebody's ancestors left somebody something or whatever the situation is, and that's how you know what I'm saying. Yeah, Jesus and God, come on, come on. Wow. Within the next uh, 30 days. So yeah, cancer season. Something definitely could take place by cancer season. June 22nd to July 22nd. There definitely could be a cancer involved. Uh, whoever shows name with this message could be a cancer. Um, or have cancer in their chart. But yeah, somebody definitely wants to take full responsibilities for their actions. For, or for their actions that, that were taken here. Or people, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no telling how many people. So, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, the ceasefire, the temporary ceasefire, yeah, I feel like uh, it ended. And I feel like uh, even though the temporary ceasefire ended, because these people don't have no more ammo, they don't have nobody to back them up, no ancestors, no uh, guardian angels, no spirit guys, no nothing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, what else they going to do besides wave the white flag, surrender? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. We got a Scorpio Sagittarius Cusper. Uh, so you could be a Scorpio Sagittarius Cusper or there's a Scorpio Sagittarius Cusper involved. Um, there's a lot of signs that came out. So with that, that has been coming out. So with that being said, yeah, there are there are many people, you know what I'm saying, that are uh, that deem themselves as adversaries, enemies, um, ops, haters, whatever. And whoever's resonating with this message, your right ear could be ringing. Um, yeah, there is some type of positive message. There is some type of good news that is coming your way. And whatever this is that's coming your way, um, yeah, nobody can take it away. What, yeah, what God has for you is for you. Um, and it definitely whatever this is um, that, that can be taken away, yeah, it's been protected by your ancestors here. For sure. While you're, yeah, you're getting ready to receive this positive news, this good news. Yeah. Uh, somebody else or pe other people are getting ready to live, yeah, in, in a very uncomfortable time of their life. Mm-hmm. Yep. Because whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you definitely could have been persecuted for the truth. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, you could have told the truth. You know what I'm saying? The fact of the matter is, the truth is, yeah. God, God is truth. You know, you could be a truth speaker. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you are one of those that tells the truth to shame the devil. So you could have told people like, yeah, y'all need to get yourselves together. You know what I'm saying? Um, or you know what I'm saying? You could have literally, yeah, shared some some truth. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that people didn't want uh for people to know. You know what I'm saying? You could just be, you know what I'm saying, an uh, energy reader. So, like, you could, yeah, tell people, like, yeah, you're you're full of shit. I can look at you right now and tell, tell that you're full of shit. Yeah, I know that you stole that gum yesterday out of Sally's purse. Yeah, you could be that type of person. You know what I'm saying? Either way it goes, God is truth. Truth is God. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Whoever's just name with this message, yeah, just know that truth and clarity is coming to assist you in making some type of decision here. But there's also some type of urgent message. Um that's coming your way you definitely could have yeah given somebody an urgent message you know what i'm saying from their ancestors you know what i'm saying um from the spirit world and somebody don't like it or people don't like it so they they they're mad at you because you told somebody the truth they're mad because yeah god or god told you to tell somebody something and you did either way it goes you could be seeing the angel number one two one one 
your hard work and your dedication will be rewarded. There's a lot of angels out here. A lot of guardian angels. Mm -hmm. I'm also picking up too that yeah, this could literally be like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, like, this could be a boss that could be being removed from a high position. You know what I'm saying? Because they came against you in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Um, and so, with that being said, yeah, if 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 you were supposed to, you know what I'm saying, still be working at this place or something like that, or this boss, um, you know what I'm saying, uh, fired you for no reason, or, you know what I'm saying, wrongful termination or whatever, you know what I mean, and the people over them didn't stand up for you or whatever the situation is, yeah, these people definitely could be feeling like jackasses as well, you know what I'm saying, because they're possibly like, yeah, they're the whole package, you know, we shouldn't have fired them, they didn't even do anything, you know what I'm saying, they were standing up for what was right, you know what I'm saying, they took care, you know what I'm saying, of, of, of the business, you know what I'm saying, they, they were the, the highest uh, productive employee that we ever had, you know, the only reason why they really were fired was because, yeah, yeah, John didn't like them. Steve didn't like them. Yeah. Somebody's name could be John or Steve. But yeah. Either way it goes. Yeah. Truth and clarity is coming to assist you in making some type of decision. And it definitely could have something to do with taking over something here. So somebody could be taking over a high position. You know what I'm saying? So somebody could be getting a job. Uh, somebody could be, yeah, be put, you know, as like uh, the power of attorney or taking, yeah taking over something but I feel like this something definitely has to do with generational wealth or definitely has something to do you know what I'm saying with uh, finances or you know what I'm saying uh, gaining a lot of finances this message is long as heck but it gotta come out anything else Holy Spirit We got a karmic mother here, so there's a karmic mother that's involved, um, that's been hiding to hiding some type of pain, and it's coming to the surface now. Um, there could be a karmic mother that could be being removed from a high position. This karmic mother could be a cancer. Mm -hmm. Whoever this karmic mother is, yeah, they they possibly want to take full responsibility for their actions. You know what I'm saying? I feel like yeah, when something takes place here. Because something big is about to take place for somebody. That's when a lot of people are going to come out of the woodwork. This could be somebody's mama, somebody's sister, somebody's brother, somebody's uncle, somebody whoop the whoop, yada yada. Um, and they basically, yeah, could be like, yeah, we apologize. You know what I'm saying? I want to take responsibility for the, the part that I played or whatever the situation is here. Um, I feel like the, yeah, there was a lot of people that persecuted uh, whoever was name with this message. For the truth, for walking in your truth, living in your truth, speaking truth. And yeah, I feel like, yeah, they already feel like jackasses. But yeah, the next 30 days, yeah, these people are really going to feel like jackasses. Uh, but somebody's uh, karmic mother could be in mental jail. There could be a lot of people in this situation that could be in mental jail here. Continue to embrace creativity and continue to embrace innovation. Because I feel like, the, yeah, at the end of the day, um, whoever's just name with this message, yeah, you're, you're, you definitely... Uh, people are definitely getting ready to be made to be believers. You know what I'm saying? So when you say, yeah, God and Jesus, when they asked you, how did you do that? How did you know that? Yeah, Jesus and God. Yeah, they're going to know. You know what I'm saying? Uh, they're going to know because they're going to see something take place just like you are. But you're going to know. You know what I'm saying? That it's God. It's Jesus. Mm -hmm. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, continue um, to embrace creativity and innovation because, yeah, um, whatever is getting ready to take place is positive news. This good news, yeah, there definitely could be people that are going to try to come in and cast light to gain some type of power and some type of control. But I feel like that that's what people have already been doing. Yeah, but you withstood the storm. Uh, but be aware because there definitely could be people still wanting to gaslight to try to gain power and, and, and control, you know, over you or over whatever is getting ready to take place. We have Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So, yeah, something about social media. So, whoever's resonating with this message, you could be, you know, you could speak some type of truth on social media. Or, yeah, there was some type of exposure that took place on social media that definitely could have backfired here. 
Yeah, we have Virgo season, so August the 23rd to September the 22nd. So, yeah, within the next 30 days, uh, some faded events definitely um, definitely could uh, pop off. You know what I'm saying? Uh, leading into what, what, what is going to be looked at as too good to be true. But whoever's resonating with this message, yeah, you're going to know that it's Jesus. You're going to know that it's God. Yeah. I feel like whoever's resonating with this message... Um, because you remained, you know what I'm saying, uh, who you are, because you, you know what I'm saying, stood fast, you know what I'm saying, and you didn't let anybody break you, bend you, uh, twist you, turn you, yeah, you're getting ready to receive something great here, um, something is definitely getting ready to take place, I feel, I feel it's something like a miracle, you know what I'm saying, but there is some truth and clarity that is coming in to assist you in making some type of decision here, so, um, yeah, be looking out for that. But anyways, y'all, that's been your message. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you soon.